Like, you, imagine this. Imagine this scenario. You are standing on the stage. You are saying, like, hello, I am Captain Owl, and today I'm going to explain to you why I am the best YouTuber. And then, like, next... <laughs> Next thing you know, I come out of nowhere and just like tackle you to the floor. <laughs> Damn. Just like, like come out of from behind the curtains or whatever and tackle you behind the floor and throw you to the ground. <laughs> and then I rip your rallet's wings off and then I eat them. Guys, it's your boy Post back here again for a brand new episode of the Silver Random Maza Nuzlocke. And today I'm actually not alone. I am joined here today by Captain Owl. Say hello, my dude. Hello. What's up? What's up, people of YouTube? If you are Owl fans, hello there. <laughs> He's nervous. He's never yeah, done this I, before. I well, no, I've, I've done this before. I'm just kind of focused on something else. Yeah. I'm actually, uh, my dog's barking. Can you hear that? Nobody can hear that. No one can hear that cat. Okay. But yeah, he's busy shiny hunting right now, and as he does that, we're gonna be communicating back and forth. And also, what I want to do is every ten episodes, I have a secret and surprise guest come onto the the channel and help me out. It's gonna be great. It's gonna be a fun time. We've only, I've only known this guy from for like a week, but you know we're good. <laughs> <laughs> he just came onto my channel one time just randomly. How did you even find my channel? Uh, I don't know. I do a lot of stream hopping. I'm like, oh, that's how I meet a lot of people, honestly, though. You're just like, oh, look at this guy. Oh, this guy seems fun. Let me just talk to him. Hey, guys, go check this guy out. You know, seriously, though, go check him out. Um, Get me to a thousand subs. I'm so close, actually. Yeah, he's like 770, but we should actually die straight into this episode right now. So, <laughs> we're just sitting here talking. Let's go to the team recap. All right, um, starting off this team recap, we have the, our wit, the milk tank, level 18, with the move, stomp, growl, defense skill, and sackle. Wait, growl? Why do you still growl? Because growling is amazing! <laughs> Don't pressure me, woman. Mel melodic has, is it a melodic? It's a milk tank, boy. Where you been? Oh, I thought you said melodic. I was just like, wait, how does melodic learn stomp and growl? Oh, if if, if you think if you think stomp and growl is interesting on a uh, my lot tick or my low tick, whatever you want to pronounce it as, wait until you hear what my starter is. So and then start in second is our starter elephant the Lugia level twenty with the moves Aeroblast, double team lovely kiss and triple kick. This boy will be drop kicking everyone. Dang. It's an interesting thing. It's a very interesting uh thing, thing indeed. But anyway. So um. <clears throat> So I walked into my room, it's okay though, everything's fine. Starting off in the next slot, we got Shell Shock of Blast, always level 20. This is why I can't record with anybody, because I'm just sitting here for like five minutes without even starting and diving into the meat of the episode. <gasps> the Water Gun Bite, Tail Whip and Tackle. This boy's going to bite you, make your wet, bite you again, and then tackle you to the ground. That sounds like a very interesting move set, if you do ask me. Next up, we got Nicki Minaj holding the brick, cause we love, cause we love beating people with bricks. Zipper in here. The name's Jinx. Shut up in the other room. I am trying to record. Who's that? That's my little sister. <laughs> She's being very distracting. With the moves, powder snow lick, lovely kiss and pound. I just encountered a Yuxi or an Uxi or whatever you want to call it. Puxi, I don't really know. You know what? Give me a second. I have to lock this freaking door because she's going in and out. Get, you know what? You talk to the, you talk to the aftermath. <laughs> and her, make them happy. Alright. So, what I'm doing right now is I'm just going into the wormhole in and out. And I'm also filling out my Pokedex. Sounds like fun, right? The Alola Pokedex is 
how, how long, how many Pokemon? Like 400 something, so I'm just gonna keep on going. Ugh, it's, it's a fun time, guys. Woo! You went quiet. Like, See, we don't, we don't, we don't have that awkward silence. I'm back, out of the way. If you couldn't tell. I legit woke up two hours ago, so just give me some slack. Awkward silence. This is also our very first time we were really talking to each other, like verbally talking to each other. So you know, we get that too. Should I catch a, Should I catch an Ultra Beast? No, our Ultra Beasts are bad. Ultra Beasts are very bad. It fills up my Pokedex though. Then do it. Anyway, <laughs> starting off third spot, we have Cheetos, a Charizard, with the moves. Oh, he's also, by the way, he's a level 20 also. With the moves, Cut, Rage, Ember, and Smoke Screen. This boy be raging because he stubbed his toe. All right. <laughs> hey. Next up, we got our MVP, Caliber Status, level 17, Spoon the Area Dose. Holding the EXP share with the moves, Poison Sting, Nightshade, Scary Face, and Constrict. I'm gonna, let's just say this, this man's OP. Like, he doesn't sound OP, but he's strong. He's a strong boy. He's stronger than Captain Owl over here. Let me just tell oh. you that much. What? What'd you say? I say he's stronger than you. Oh boy, that's actually <laughs> kind of scary. Yeah, th th this spider is gonna get all up in your grill, and I'm saying just like, yo! I'm gonna give you some loving. <laughs> anyway. Uh, I'll, I'll, uh, my, um, I'll just, I'll just eat that spider. I'll eat it. Actually, I, f I, f I forgot something. I forgot to do something. I'll eat spiders. You know what? We'll just leave him on the team for this episode. I'll, I'll take him off next episode. Cause I, like we last episode we caught a Doug trio and it was like the rebirth of our fallen comrade in a past series and I need him trio. Just because of that. But anyway, we're going to go get some counters to encounters today. Because why not? You know what I'm saying? Yeah, wait. What are your rules for your Nuzlocke? Isn't it just like the same? Yeah, it's a, it's, it's a, it's a Nuzlocke. It's a regular Nuzlocke. We got a Slowpoke Tail. That's what we're talking about. We got that oh, healthy. Dang. Isn't that thing like a million dollars or something? That's what I'm saying. We stole this man's Slowpoke Tail and we going to eat it. I'm going to give your avatar a tail. I don't know, but we're going to figure this one out right now. That's what I'm talking about. This is going to be like a good hour of power just between you and I. Because <laughs> we're getting nowhere. Whoops. All right, let's see what it says. Slowpoke tail. Very tasty. Sell high. Very straightforward, straight to the point. <laughs> yes, it is. Go away. Oh, let me put this on pause real quick. Be right back. All right, we are back once again. Um, apparently, Al got was able to get his I got shi a shiny Metacham. What he said? He got it a shiny Metacham. Yep. We are only seven minutes into this episode. I hope you know that. You're gonna be here for a little bit longer now. That's fine. I don't care. But anyway, as we were talking about beforehand, Slowpoke Tail is very tasty, and has a you just sell it high. That's that's it. So, yeah, it's straightforward to the point. Hey, this man got his first shiny of the day. Uh, my second shiny. Of the day. Second shiny in Ultra Sun, but my first shiny of the day, yeah. Awesome. Yo, so we're uh, we're in this... We're, so I, I am currently in a cave, and we're going to get our first encounter of the night. And let, well, let's see what we got. And we got ourselves a Raticate. Raticate so. wants that slow poke tail. Seriously though, let's get that Raticate tail. If you don't know what I'm talking about, um, I'm pretty sure, is it heart gold or is it also silver? Is it the original games or is it, is it in the, oh god, this thing used quick attack. It scared me, I didn't know what it was doing. But um, <laughs> I'm just like, going in circles now. but anyway, uh, I don't know if it's in the very beginning, like, you know, the, if it's been in there since the beginning where like, you know, you have to, I only have three balls. Why have I not, not sure, but like, you know, I don't know if it's in the very beginning or if it's just in the remakes where it's just like, oh, let's get, you know, like you have to put the code in to get to like the boss's room or something like that. And it's like slow poke tail, this, that, the other. Like eradicate, eradicate tail was also one of those. So fun fact for y'all. Or it's eradicate tail, and now we're going to get the slow poke tail. We got the eradicate. That is what we're talking about. Up in here. What level? What level? We got eradicate level. 15! 
Oh, dang. This man be brown. Browner than my turds. Like, oh, yeah. <laughs> That's too much information. <laughs> that is, yeah, that, no. Nah. <laughs> It's okay, last episode on the channel, um... Touch that stupid wormhole, come on now. <laughs> so what should I name, I'm going, should I name this thing, a uh, cat? And after you? No, no, just wait until an owl appears and it'll be like, yeah, that's me. <laughs> Woo! Woo! I'm just dead inside. But what should I name this rat cat then, mister? Uh, name it, you know, you know that fat rat from, um, Ratatouille? I know what you're talking about, I don't know the name. Whatever it's called. Damn. Uh. Wait, no, it's like it's Remy, right? No, wait, that's the that's the main character, right? Um, I'm gonna look it up on on the internet right now. So during this. Wait, I think I remember. Isn't it Emil or something like that? I'm looking it up right now. We're gonna hear some tick 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 and click click click. So uh, <laughs> so th this entire episode is going wrong, but wrong in all the good ways. Wait, no, it's it's Emil, right? Fat rat. In rat ratatouille name. There you go. We gotta get that, <laughs> guys. Yeah, it's a meal. Oh wow! I actually just got it. Woo. All right. So um, we're gonna name this thing a meal because you know Captain Al is our guest. He gets to name all of our um, you know, encounters in today's episode. Give him a little welcome to the uh, channel. Hope to see him around more often. To my channel if you haven't. Yeah, guys, go check out Captain Al. He's an amazing friend. And an amazing content creator. He does a lot of live streams. Right now he's doing um, Ultra Sun, Ultra Moon on Do Belief. But yeah, you definitely guys have to go check him out. Go give him a sub. Get him even closer to that 1K. Also... Get closer to that letter. That K. Yeah, that 1K, my boy. But, uh, yeah. and also, also the, the biggest, in the biggest thing right here. Don't forget to go and drop a like and a sub to both me. And uh, what's your name again? I'm Ken. No. I, I, I'm Ken. Go, go, go give us both a subscription if you guys have not already. I'm going to go and tell him to go and send his people over here to watch this episode of Shenanigans. That does not... You no, know, I'm just talking. I can't talk and do the game at the same time whenever there's two people here. <laughs> See, this is why my uh, soul links would link is... Uh, which is kind of ironic because his name is Link. It does a uh, very, I mean, it does really well view wise. Like, everybody loves it. Everybody thinks we have like really good synergy together. But it's more yeah. the, but, but, but the, it's more of the fact that, uh, I, we don't get anything done. We go like, t no! <laughs> what happened, man? I'm in a stupid normal wormhole. Oh my god, it's a rival! It's a rival! Oh, it's you. You wanted to get stronger, so you came for the. I got a sigilil, sig sigilif, sigililif, whatever it's called. Yo, sigilif is a coconut. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's not. It's like a Mexican, um, one of those like Mexican charms. I don't really know what they're called. No, listen, listen. Here, here's my crackpot theory for today. Sigilif is a coconut. And you might be wondering, why is Sigilyph a coconut? Well, I came to the realize, I came to the realization. Whenever it is shiny, it gets that brown where it's green. And guess what else happens when a coconut is ripe? It goes from brown, wait, green to brown. <laughs> so. If it goes from brown to green, that'd be very concerning. And and it look okay. So it goes in like, it looks like a broken coconut. Oh wow. Think about it. Just let it sink in. Sigilyph is a coconut. It looks like it's, it's wearing a coconut shell. No comment. <laughs> just sitting there. Mm -hmm. Okay. No, I'm just thinking about that for a second. Yeah, let's say Sigilyph is just wearing a coconut shell. This is... This has got awkward silence. Anyway, I'm going back to... I'm focused on the stupid ultra wormholes. <laughs> this man. I dodge all of them right now. <laughs> ah, no. This man be crazy. Anyway, I'm going back to reading this man's dialogue. That's supposed to be... Wait, I, this voice just went from... Uh-huh. 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 U
I'm going to be the world's greatest trainer, and so a legendary would be perfect for me. That's not gonna be a shiny. There's no way. It's a shiny. I'm going to freak. <clears throat> it's a 1,800 light years away. It's, there's no way. Watch this man get a shiny. Nope. Normal metachamp. <laughs> yes. Well, anyway, I'm getting tired of having a wimp like you always showing up. <laughs> I love how I, I read that kind of like directed towards Cap, so it was like I'm telling him I'm tired of having him around. <laughs> Change my haircut. Like, this is. My character looks super gross right now. Dude, he looks just like you. What are you talking about? I'm talking about my character in game. Where did you get a haircut? Wait, where do I get a haircut in this place? I don't know. I honestly don't care. But I anyway. I'm gonna go back into the ultra world. Alright, have fun in your hole. Whoa. <laughs> Yo, Cap is over here just exploring every hole. Like, this is what my boy does. G ladies, you better watch out. He's coming for your hole. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I had, it had to be said. It had to be said. There's only so much I can do. Alright, so Spoon would like to battle. Spoon sent out Weepin' Bell. Oh my god, it's Turtle's dad. Cap doesn't know who Turtle is, guys. Turtle Turtle, Turtle was our um, our Bell Sprout that we had, and also our very first death. Oof. He only he lasted one up for Turtle. Yeah. He lasted one episode. <laughs> I'm like, you got this turtle. Well he well, needless to say he didn't have it. He died in the arms of his own trainer, who caught him, named him Turtle for no reason at all. Just because I thought it was cool. Like, yo, if I had a kid, I'm going to definitely name my child Turtle. You know why? Because Turtle is the best thing ever. I'm not even paying attention to the game. I'm just talking to you. But <laughs> Turtle's great. Turtle is the most amazing creature that I've ever seen in my life. I don't know what you're, think you're talking about. But, uh, man. Turtle is the best. Yo, Wit is asleep. I don't know how she got asleep. I guess a sleep powder or something. I'm not, like I said, I'm not even paying attention. <clears throat> Yo, Cap, what time do you yeah. what time do you do you usually stream? Like around eight. PM. Like PM seven six. This man. But yeah, go check him out. His streams are fun. Fun. Wow, actually, I, no, listen, 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 listen. Listen. I got a ultra wormhole, 4,321. This man be acting like that's important or something. <laughs> it's important. It's perfect. <laughs> and I did not get a shiny. This man be up in here like, yo, I, I want a shiny. Can I get a shiny? And the, the, the game's like, no. Oh my god. Mm-hmm. You know what gets really bad? Mm -hmm. I, I honestly hate them too, man. I, I lost like 10 because of it. Which is honestly doesn't sound like a lot, but whenever it's coming from like a huge, like, well, it's not, not saying a huge, but like a small channel such as you and I, ten, like losing 10 is like losing like a tenth of your entire fan base. <laughs> no. It's like, I need you, please come. Yo, I, I have to, I actually have to be careful right now. I have to like focus on the game for a second. So, Wit is asleep. She's at 20 health. And I accidentally press tackle. Oh. I hope I have potions. But like seriously, I have to pay attention now. You you talk about something amusing. So it doesn't sound terrible. Um Okay, um is a very hold up. Why you you right on Sogalio or okay, we don't have any potions, so this is a very Sogalio, bad Sogalio or Sogalic? <coughs> I'm pretty sure it's Sogalio, like, Gal. Sogalio. Huh? I think Sogalio, it's kind of awkward, but like, whatever. I think, I think it's Sogalio. Alright, so we killed that Weeping Bell, we are freed from rap. We have to get out of oh, here. Yeah, like Sol, like Sun? Yeah, like Solar, Sogalio. Um, Sogalio. Alright, um... Leo is definitely right, but... So Sogalio. How about the Gal? What is Gal? 
So, I don't know, I guess it's a fun way of pay, putting the two words, yeah, like, yeah, let's put- Galaxy? Go maybe Galaxy? Maybe you're just looking too much into his name? That could be I another- No, I don't- I'm, I'm kinda curious. <laughs> Yo, this entire episode, like I said, isn't even about the game, it's just you and I talking to each other. <laughs> and, the, like I said, it sounds like we've actually known each other for quite some time, by the, our commentary and talking together, but in actuality, we do not even know each other. Yeah, we don't even know, like, we don't, we have no idea which, which is... We, we've known each other for about, we've known each other for about a week. Yeah. And, and that's saying something. Come on, Sogaleo, or Sogaleo. Yo, wait, wait, I'm gonna put, I'm gonna, I'm gonna put you on the spot right now, okay, Cap? If anybody wants to see me do a versus series with Captain Al, make sure you smash that like button and let me know in the, uh, let us know in the comment section below. Honestly, we're we're totally different opposites. You're super intense, and I'm just like chilling here, you know, just doing my own thing. Yeah, that that's what makes this crazy. Like you're just like, yeah, man. Whatever you say, I'm just. Four thousand light years away. <laughs> like you're just sitting there, just like, yeah, man. Everything's everything's chill, man. We don't know what you're talking about, but I'm just sitting here. Yeah, man. I'm just oh, like. I got a quag sire. Huh. He was, this is so derpy looking. It's like, <laughs> <laughs> I, no, I, I connect with Quagsire. <laughs> you look like a Quagsire. Quagsire is my spirit animal. Quagsire is my spirit animal, man. I don't know about you, but like, my if I had to have a spirit animal, it would be you. Okay. You are my spirit animal. A Captain Owl, like an owl pirating a ship through stri- see what I'm going live. Uh... In like He's typing. If you could not hear it already. Three hours. <clears throat> Porygon two. Yeah. By the way, guys. Uh, this we breaking the fourth wall as we speak. Firstly, I'm not wearing any pants, and secondly, I am recording this Sunday, so this will most likely get out to you Monday, and I have to go and stream like two hours after getting done with this. So you know, it's an interest. I, have, I literally have nothing on Monday. <laughs> I love how you just completely disregarded the entire fact that I'm not wearing any pants. <laughs> yeah, no, that's kind of concerning. I just wanted to kind of ignore that. He's like, I'm talking to this man and I'm not wearing any pants. Oh. Wanna see? <laughs> Yo, how many times have you ever had a Lugia as your starter? I bet never. Yo, this man is recovering his health. I'm not enjoying this at all. I'm just telling you that now. I'm not enjoying this at all. Like, this man gotta stop recovering his health. I wanna, like, blow him away with an arrow blast. Oh my god! I am going to stress. Ow, this man is stressing me out, man. I can't kill this freaking por. I can't kill this Porygon. It keeps recovering. It keeps spamming recover. You have no idea how stressful this is. That's literally me in a Wi Fi battle. Oh my god, it's just good. Oh my god! This man is <laughs> stressing me. Every single time, I'm just like. Mewtwo, go! Recover, 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 recover. <laughs> I can't kill this thing. I'm, I'm almost out of Aeroblast, man. Oh my god, thank god it used Psybeam for once in his life. It's just like... Yeah. I mean, it's not very effective, but now we're gonna kill it with an Aeroblast. So that's amazing. That's great. It lived. It lived! There's a risk going into the Ultra Wormhole like this. It's just... You grab, you grab one of those orb things, and then you keep on going, but then the risk is you're gonna run into a bad wormhole, and you're just gonna have to stick with it. This thing is actually stressing me out, man. You have no idea. It had like four health left, and it went for another recover. Oof. I'm gonna have to like, oh my god. I am actually stressing out right now. Like, I, I am like, ah! <laughs> Sorry, hear that, bro? Oh, let's go, let's go, let's go. This is it. Shiny, shiny madness. Shiny madness right here. Guys, it's not gonna be a shiny. Double wormhole, double, it, double green wormhole. It's not gonna be a shiny. It's not gonna be a shiny. 800 light years away, no legendary. It's not gonna be a shiny. You're, you don't think it's gonna be a shiny? I don't think it's gonna be a shiny. Oh my god, it's a quagsire. Ah, ha, ha. Ah, ha. That's the fakest laugh I've ever done in my life. I wanted, I wanted to name my Quagsire 
bubblegum or something like that. It's so pink and so amazing. You know, you're so pink and you're so... Oh, we froze us Porygon. <laughs> Yay! Oh, God, this Porygon's actually giving us a lot of trouble. I'm just going to fast forward through this. Like, holy crap. so much money in this game. I have like $300,000. Why do you have that much money? I've beat the Elite Four tens of millions of times. I'm going to like tail whip this thing to death. Because that, that, that kills, right? Tail whip kills? Yeah, I believe so. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's an attacking move, right? Yeah. That's a, that's a good move, I'm pretty sure. Yo, Spoon grew to level 19 and Spoon was defeated. You are not a shiny, go away. Go away! Yo, let's have a singing competition right now. Nah, I'm good. Ah, whatever. <laughs> I'm just reading this line, and it's great. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna go and get another encounter. Wait, I forgot balls. I have to go get some balls first. But man, I like you. You're- you're fun. Not- not- not-, not no- no- no homo. <laughs> what? I said no homo. <laughs> I like you. You're fun. No homo, though. That was kind of concerning. I mean, considering that you're only like 10 years old, I mean, yeah, obviously it'll be concerning. I'm not 10 years old. He only acts like it, ladies and gentlemen. He only acts like he's 10 years old. A wild card boot! You okay? <laughs> no, I have cancer. A wild card boot! Tops appeared. <laughs> oh, I forgot to heal. No, that's concerning. I forgot to take off. Okay. This episode has been a mess, but one of those good messes. You know what I'm saying? Like, everything's going wrong in the right way. You know what I'm saying? No! Yes, you do. Don't lie to me. Stupid. Normal wormhole. <laughs> those only have a 1% chance of the thing inside being shiny. You know that, right? Actually, it was like a 1 ring. I guess it was like a 10% chance, but it's gonna be nothing. Well, I mean, it depends. Those type of things depend. Like, I have an entire chart saved somewhere. I, Can I just start completing the Pokedex and just give up on the shinies? No. No? No. Huh? I said no, boy! <laughs> I said no! <laughs> I'm so loud. <laughs> you are loud. I need to turn my volume down. Welcome to my world, and welcome to literally the Aftermath world. Like, they, this is what they have to deal with on a daily basis. <laughs> I have problems. I was going to- hold on. How- how- how much have I completed the Pokedex right now? 25%? 28%? Mm -hmm. Oh, that's right. I completed the Pokedex. We're just so. chilling. This is- this entire episode is just me and you chilling. Except I'm never chilled out. Like, I'm always either really stressed, really goofy, or just screaming. Or hyper and screaming. So, I mean. And just like, yo, what's up, guys? Um, the, I am Captain Owl, and today I'm going to go and tell you about why I am the best YouTuber on the planet. And then, like, and then I bust out of the back room and just, like, like, attack you on the side, from the side of the stage, you know what I'm saying? Like, stage bot reverse stage dive you and just like attack like a, ca a rabied cat <laughs> That's very concerning. like y imagine this imagine this scenario you are standing on the stage you're saying like hello i am captain owl and today i'm going to explain to you why i am the best youtuber and then like next <laughs> next thing you know i come out of nowhere and just like Tackle you to the floor. <laughs> Damn. Just like, like come out of from behind the curtains or whatever, and tackle you behind the floor and throw you to the ground. <laughs> and then I rip your rallet's wings off, and then I eat them like chicken wings, and put, and then like I, I, I somehow like pull some like barbecue sauce or something out of my pants. <laughs> Don't know why they're down there in there, but you know. But in the process, I take and just start dipping your like mascot's wings. And to oh, some wing sauce, and, I, and then I make you eat them. That doesn't sound good. I, I can't catch the stupid kaboot tops. I'm just sitting here. All right, ready? Ready? Why do you... I'm, I, I, I love how I can't catch anything, but yet at the same time, I have, like, every everything on my team almost has a status move. Like, three out of the six has yes, something. I found a ladybug. 
Yay, it's a bug. I love bugs. Oh my god, yay, girl. You get that ladybug. Oh my god, you totally got this. I killed it! Why? <laughs> oh lord. I hope you guys are enjoying this episode if you guys have not clicked. I got clicked. one XP point from that. <laughs> I got one XP point. Thank you. <laughs> oh my god. Completing the Pokedex has been so easy. Oh my god. And honestly, honestly, yes. I want to get one more encounter in today's episode. And then I'm actually going to go and do some story wise stuff. Where do I... This is going to be a nice hour of power. It's a Jigglypuff. I'm not bothering with this thing. Do I need to go into nighttime mode for this? Spiders are nocturnal, right? Yeah. Spiders are nocturnal, right? No! They're, they're not nocturnal. Have you have you ever, like... I'm walking into a building. I'm not even paying attention. <laughs> Dude, spiders are not nocturnal. Some spiders are. Some spiders are, but a lot of them aren't. They just sit there and wait yeah. for something to come into their web, a.k.a. the human being, and then afterwards... Ugh. And afterwards, they prey on the awaiting flesh of a human and bite them. Or if they don't bite them, you're just stuck there, you know, freaking flailing around in their web because you walked into it because you're not paying, ugh, paying attention. I told you that my dog got bit by a spider and, and the spider was like still in her. The spider was still in your dog after bit biting him. Yep. How does that work? <laughs> It was, like, really concerning. We had to take her to the bed. Yo, we found a lure ball. Let's go. I, like, freaked out. I was the one who had to take it out. Ew. It was, like, it was, like, wiggling its little arm. I just, I, 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 I shut the tweezers out of the window. I just was, like, no. Yo, this is no. making me sick. This is a sickening story about how his dog got bit by a spider. Nah, just kidding. I hate the spider. Oh! <laughs> I am an owl, after all. Who? <laughs> Yum. Better delish. Yeah, I'm gonna have to end off this episode soon. This episode's been going on for almost 30 minutes now. Hold on. Okay, where's the stupid spider? Um... Oh my god! Whoa! Hold up. What? I'm gonna hear speeding through this thing. What the heck is a berserk gene? What the heck is a berserk gene? I don't know what that is. I don't know what, I don't know what the heck is a berserk gene. That's an item? I am Googling this. Google is our friend. What the heck is a berserk gene? Because we, we encountered a polywhirl, and this thing had a berserk gene. It's like it's his berserk gene activated. I'm like, what the heck is a berserk gene? I don't know. How do you spell it? Oh, I got this thing. Berserk gene. Bo Bulbapedia, help us. Berserk gene. Confuses the holder. For the a duration of 256 turns. Oh god. <laughs> but it raises its attack for two stages as soon as it enters the battle. No, I'm trying to beat you. <laughs> oh my god. Um, I want a Pikachu. I have a Raichu. Alright, but um, the Berserk Gene is consumed even if the holder is already confused or holding 6 plus attack stages when it enters the battle. Due to the baton pass. If a confused Mon is switched out and replaced by a Mon holding the Berserk Gene, the holder will be confused for remaining duration of the, of the first confu- This is confusing. <laughs> Why the heck is there an- why is there an item that confuses you for 256 turns? Excuse me, but what game freak? You could just enter the uh, the game and just set up a sword stance and call it good. You know that, right? Yeah. Holy crap. 256 uh, turns. Uh, okay. <clears throat> I don't know what else to do here. So, um, all I know is that there's, um, Oh my god, it's a shuckle! Dude! Catch it! I can't, it's a, it'll be a legal capture. <laughs> well, I mean, we are already healed up and all, so I mean... 
I guess this is the end of the episode. <laughs> I mean, I'm still trying to fill up my Pokedex. I mean, Captain Al ain't important, so, I mean, I'm the important. Spinner Rack! Spinner Rack! <laughs> appeared. So, I mean, I guess this is where we end off the episode and we part ways. Sweet. Sweet. But, uh, if you guys, I'll do the outro. I mean, we don't have to heal because we've already kind of, you know, done all that just recently. If you guys enjoy this episode, make sure you like, comment if you want us to do an actual series together. If, you know, it, it we sound like we would work out. I don't know. I don't know personally. And, uh, subscribe to both me and Captain Al if you're not already. Or you could just comment and have a direct link to your channel. Sure, that makes sense. I could do that as well. <laughs> hey. I, I was kind enough to put you in the episode. Yeah. Wait, how did that Spinarak escape an Ultra Ball? Because I, I, you're getting me so, so, so distracted. Anyway, if you level three. This we can't we, we can't do um the outro. Anyway, uh, okay, <laughs> you 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 made me feel like I the, I, 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 I I can't even speak. You know what? <laughs> but yeah, guys. Without further ado, I post and. I was I was gonna have you state your uh, case, but oh oh. I so anyway, I guess I'll be seeing you guys next time. I was your boy Post, and I was joined today by me, Captain Al. And we will see you guys next time. I do. Bye.